welcome back to my channel. I am reviewing a new short bob wig, which I am very, very excited about. This is the sister company, and the name of this wig is Slay H. Gia. I've seen Gia on a couple of YouTubers here, and I just really, really wanted to have another short wig that I wanted to test out and try and wear at work. Um, I do work in the food industry, so it is nice to have your hair not be so long. Um, and I've been really, really loving that. So Gia was definitely the wig that I was, um, you know, seeking after. Once I got this wig in my hand, I already knew that this was gonna be a very pretty wig. The moment even when I put it on, I was like, oh, she's really pretty. <laughs> Um, I just love the way it looks. Um, I've always been conscious of how short the wigs look, but as you can see, I'm in love and you will see more. Stay tuned. Hey loves, welcome back to my channel. So, decided to get a couple of short wigs um, just because it was just too hot wearing all the wigs. So I got Gia, and this is um, the sister wig uh, company, you know, sis. And um, this is Slay Lace H Gia. Um, absolutely beautiful. Um, I've never had a blunt wig, but um, I think, I think, I think I'm gonna be wearing blunt wigs because of what? This is so pretty. Now I do want to go in, and I know I always do this thing. God, I didn't do it in the. I normally don't do it on. I try not to do it in a review, but I always tweak my wig somehow, some way. But with this one, I am gonna tweak it a little bit just because I needed to frame my face. That's just the thing I like. You know what, I'm gonna just go ahead and do it because that's the way I would wear my wig. So give me one second. Okay, loves, so I went ahead and I tried to bump a little bit of the straightness that was in this wig. Now I will say this wasn't a easy fiber wig. Um, I know like they say um, wigs um, that are synthetic can be, um, you know, curled. Um, this one was hard to curl. I couldn't get it to, it took me a minute to get it to even do this. Um, so I cut it where it shape, uh, framed my face and then I bumped it. So with this type of wig, you have to go small, less is way more. Um, just because if you try to do it all at once, like I was just taking sections, it would not curl for me. So I was going in smaller and I got it to do this a little bit. Um, I did a little bit over here trying to, I tried, okay. Um, but this is as much as I can do for right now. I know if I go in again and I try to do it in smaller sections, but this is what it looks like right now for me doing it. Um, in the smaller sections, so I am going to try to do more on this side, but I'm in love with it. Like, I love this wig. <laughs> I've been wanting a very short bob wig. Um, um, I don't know, I just, I never really tried to mess with bobs, and I was like, come on, I'm going to get a bob. And I now got a bob, and it looks so good. I freaking love it. I can't pour. Um, but this one was really, really pretty to just see how it looks on me. Even though I'm not too crazy about the fibers that they're using on this wig, I still think it's a pretty wig just because of the way it's designed. Um, the lace is it's actually pretty good. I use my, hold on, I want to make sure I get this, uh, my compact. I use Black Radiance on bronze. I don't know what the bronze this is. Um, I guess it's like their pressed foundation powder. I always use this as a bronzer. Um, I just love it. I get um, the, the name is Ebony. The number is 8615. I always use this for my wigs because I normally put this around my phone or anywhere on my face. So using a bronzer or a you know darker tone where you do that on the side of your face I mean, around your perimeter of your face this is way better to use on your wigs just because it will actually line up really really well against the skin so i'm definitely going to be rocking this wig for a minute just because i love this wig it looks so good on me and um yeah i just always was like not too keen on short wigs because i just thought i had a rounder face it would make me look like I don't know, I just didn't think it would go with my face shape. So this is absolutely 
pretty and I'm in love. It looks so good. And I know when I go in and I curl it more, it's gonna look really, really nice. It looks really, really good on me. I am like shocked right now. But yeah, this is the way it looks. I hope you guys like this wig. If you guys wanna get your hands on this wig, please do. It is very, very nice. Even though the fibers are a little bit harder to work with, I think just in a smaller section, you'll get the look that you're looking for. Um, I also, I think you should definitely frame your face when it comes to this wig. I know a lot of people like to wear it like the way it came blunt, but framing your face really, really adds to the wig. It looks like it's your hair. Um, and uh, yeah, I think it would be really, really cute to see it um, in the fall, actually. It looks so good. So yeah, definitely wearing this in the fall. It is so, so cute. And uh, yeah, let me know what you guys think of this wig. Again, I will have the specs below. I'll have the link below. I'll have the pricing below. And of course, again, where I got my wig. So yeah, I will talk to you guys later. And I will see you guys next time in another video. Bye. Thanks for checking out my video, guys. I have another video up on my channel. Do I love it or do I hate it? We'll see.